Hello Zebra Herd, welcome to Zebra's Arcade, a series where we try a new game every episode. And today, we're trying We Love Katamari, Reroll Plus, Royal Reverie. This is another Katamari remake, this time of the original We Love Katamari, and it seems like a ton of fun. I love the Katamari series, and this just seems to be more goofy action. So, let's try out We Love Katamari, Reroll Plus, Royal Reverie. The Great Cosmos, a world of mystery both tantalizing and terrifying. Not a very well publicized world to understand, but a glamorous and influential world nevertheless. Ooh, very pretty. Bold yet sensitive and rugged to boot. Tolerant and compassionate with a heart deeper than the oceans. Such is the great cosmos, and the king that rules over it is marvelous to behold. Except for the one time that he destroyed all the stars in the universe. <laughs> no big deal, really. Having come to and realized the folly of his ways, the wisest of kings sent to the planet Earth his beloved son, the prince and commanded him to make a Katamari of ample proportions. Tossed unceremoniously to earth, the valiant prince rolled the Katamari entrusted to him by the king, rolling up more things than you can count. Vaulting boxes, pencils, Erasers, postcards, ramen, robots, cows, sheep, this girl, that boy, moms and dads, bicycles, and dads, bicycles, rainbows, clouds, islands, rainbows, and dreams. The prince rolled a lot of stuff. Rolled and rolled until the Katamari was big enough to be lifted up to space to replace the shiny stars that were so grievously lost. And that, dear friends, was the plot and purpose of the fabulous game called... Katamari Dabrasi! Its popularity recognized no boundaries or borders, and it rolled right out of the game to bundle away the many and sundry ills that blight the modern world. Overnight, the king found himself a superstar. The adulation of the crowd knew no limits. I want to meet the king! I think he should be bigger. The king is so cool. I want to roll up more stuff. Oh, dear, such a chorus. Fans crying out from all over the world for the magnificent king to do his thing. Wow! Wow, indeed. We love Katamari. So because the fans demanded it, a sequel is here. Then let's get into it. Let's get to rolling. We have a whole... Cosmos to roll up, it seems. Uh oh, is that the sun? Can we roll with the sun? Still not enough stars here. Guess we gotta fill it up. And it's the king again. Ah, sweet memories. Yes, there was that time. That time we smashed all the stars in the sky. It's like something out of a dream. We so totally forgot. Mm hmm. What made us remember? Looky, the only place with stars is around Earth. Looks like Katamari Damacy was being lazy. <laughs> Looks like Katamari Damacy had everyone fooled. What impress impresses us all over is the scale of destruction we wrought. We were on our roll. Yes, we were. Fierce and fabulous, we certainly were. We were really something. Yes, yes. Oh, speaking of something, here's a tidbit. Not that we get it, but it seems we're quite a hit. A big hit with Earth. A star so full of stuff. A star now apparently full of our fans. Prince, Prince, what do you think they love about us? Our looks, our tights, our mustache. Oh, Eureka, we've got it. It's our chin, yes. That must be, yes, must be. Our chin is so magnificent. Earth is full of dedicated followers to our, of our chin. I wanna hold your chin, let me fill your goatee. They ask so nicely, so passionately. How can we say no? 
So now, our prince, you must go to Earth and grant our fan fans their wishes. Their wishes are our chin's commands. Our chin's commands are our wishes, and so on. So I guess we're heading back to Earth just to roll stuff up, just like we did in the first game. Which we did a full series on Katamari Damacy reroll when it came out. Uh, but, oh, seems like somebody needs our help. Yes, yes. It looks like the fans in the select plaza want to ask the prince something. Talk to them. An icon will be displayed at the bottom of the screen when new fans arrive. Make their dreams come true. Okay, sure. So we have this fan over here. Oh, I forgot. How do I do this? Nice to meet you, your highness. Katamari Damacy is fun. Or it was fun. I think it must have been fun. I'm sorry. I've forgotten. I've completely forgotten how to roll the Katamari. I know I'm a goof, but I love Katamari Damacy. Help me remember, please? Sure. I sort of forgot how to play too. It's been a good few years, so. I guess we'll get sort of the, the crash course here. Alrighty, let's leave our fans on Earth to the prince. Now, where shall we go and play? Oh, the, it's the prince. What do you want with us? What? Oh, you forgot. Forgot how to roll the Katamari, how to enjoy the Katamari. The meaning of life, of course you forgot. It's the things you can't forget that make you hurt. We think it may be better not to dredge things up. Your highness is cool. Cool. No, it's import to re important to remember. No, it's crucial to remember, yes. We'll just try and think back, yes. All right, so we're heading into the first level. I have no idea what that said. Friends that forgot all about Katamari Damacy, or friends playing their very first game of Katamari Damacy. For all friends old and new, the prince will roll in their place. So, what is a Katamari? What could a Katamari be? What does it taste like? <laughs> does it have a point? Why roll? Why make it bigger? So many opinions and schools of thought, but let's just try it first, yes? Hear ye, hear ye. We present to all and sundry, the Katamari. Pretty simple to start with. Here it is. This is an average Katamari, so utterly devoid of any new. An improvedness. Take this standard Katamari and roll it firmly with both hands. Use your left and right hands to roll, get it? You get it? That's enough, yes? We did good, yes? So just roll your way around until you've mastered Katamari. Damacy on your own. Alrighty, see the yellow platform ahead? For now, let's head on over there. Okay, so as you can see, we can roll it all over the place like this, but we can just sort of roll one way at a time to look left or right, and then we can climb over things by just pushing it over a wall like this, right? Hey, we got, we got on the platform. Oh yes, you got up there. Good, good, you're so smart. All righty then, go ahead and roll up stuff. Roll up a lot and grow nice and big. Will do, so if we roll things up, we'll get bigger. That's sort of the whole idea of the game, right? So. We'll try to do that, we'll just roll up everything we can. Now there's certain things that might be too big to roll up at first, but the bigger we get, the more larger things we can roll up. So things like that we gotta focus on. Like we can't quite get up that hill at the moment, but if we get really, really big, we might be able to actually get up there at some point. So I'll roll that up for now. And there's a lot of stuff over uh, around here. It does take a little bit to get sort of used to the controls. I will say that much, but we'll get there for sure. So there we go, now we're larger. Oh. You've grown, good, good, you're so cute. Thank you very much. With Katamari that big, you can climb up even higher. Try it, try it. Let's try it. Okay, so we got some of this. I might just try to get a little bit more before we roll up, because I just, I get very addicted to rolling up as many things as we can. Now typically the difficulty with the game comes in with the time limit, but this seems plenty enough. I'll roll over here, we'll get through all this, and then Try to climb up, come on, come on! We got it, awesome! Whoa, other people are rolling around their stuff. Wow, he's got up there safe and sound. So you can see there's some things here I just can't quite pick up. Oh, wow, yet another thing you can do. Okay, so it looks like we do have different things. We can do the Prince Dash by moving left and right at the same time, like this, whoa! And then we have the Prince View with L1. Whoa, we can sort of do first person, where we have normal eye and then miracle eye, where we zoom in. Interesting. Then of course we have a uh, Prince Turn, where if we press both buttons at once, or for both analog sticks. Oh, there we go. Uh, when you're just a little bigger, you can maybe roll Ace up. Here, this is Ace, a cousin to the Prince. Or a cousin once removed, we forget. Cousin, kin, something like that. Alrighty, time for you to challenge Ace head on. So we'll do that in just a moment. But we also have Katamari View, which I guess is sort of the same thing, but not first person. So we'll roll up as much as we can and then try to get Ace over here. Where are you at? Ace, okay, here you are, here you are, I'm coming for you, Ace. Ah, 
It looks like he might be too big to roll up at the moment. Oh no, we're getting some of the little Katamari, or whatever they are, the little cousins of the prince that are flying around here too. And let's just turn around like this and try to catch up to you. Still can't quite catch you. So we just need to roll more stuff so that we can get bigger and get ace. I can get you. There we go. 20 more over this way too. Wow, now we're really getting a lot bigger. This is gonna change things up for sure. So, oh, grab all of those. Now we're huge. So where's Ace at? I got gotcha, you. I got gotcha. you. You better run. You get back here. All right, I might turn around a little bit. Where did Ace run off to? Right over here. So, gotcha. Fabulous. You're pretty good. Anyway, let's go back. Royal Rainbow. That was a lot of fun. So, pretty solid Katamari there for sure. But of course, that was sort of more our trial run. Hmm, was it like this? Katamari down the sea? Honestly, this is not what we were thinking of. But it looks kind of fun, a kind of sort of fun game. 18 centimeters, nine millimeters, we we see it. We are a little touched. So big and just from a training run. An unbelievable size and astonishing, really. Very and truly fabulous. Oh, it's Cousin Ace. What were you doing on Earth? Hmm? You were at the tutorial stage? We have no idea what you're talking about. Hmm. This feels, this Katamari feels strange-ish. Not that we understand if that's a good thing or not. Oh wow, I remembered everything. Really everything this time. It's totally the best Katamari Damacy. Your Highness, thank you so much. This Katamari is just a token of my thanks. I'd like to offer it to you. Ooh, really? You're giving it to us? Seriously? Fabulous, thank you, we are so pleased. What should we do with it? Oh. We can pop it up into the cosmos. Yes, that's what we'll do. So with each Katamari that we complete, we get to send it up into the sky. It makes up another star. Oh wow, it made a planet. Look, it's a star now. Wow, it's so beautiful. No way planet. We also get, we also love Soccer Kid. We totally forgot to tell you, but this is the Select Plaza. Talk to fans, chat with cousins. Do a little saving. Look at your collection. Move around a little, maybe while pressing square R1. When you get tired of rolling, just hang out here. Okay, see, so we can just run around real fast. We can check out different things, like our collection. Um, we have cousins to talk to, like Ace. Um, hi, Ace. That doesn't seem, oh, I can turn into Ace. Oh, that's so cool. But we have a new person to talk to. I wanna see uh, the Royal Rainbow. Hello, your highness. I just love you. That beard, that nose, that chin, that style, that crown. I love it all, but I love the Royal Rainbow the best of all. My dream is to see a real live one. Please show me. Sure. So I guess we're trying to make a rainbow here. We are hungry. Our tummy is empty. What shall we eat? Oh, it's the prince. Mm -hmm. What? What kind of food? Huh? Royal Rainbow? Why, when our tummy is so empty? Ugh. No way. Boring. Striking. Your Highness, you're so striking. Oh. We so like rainbows, you must simply, or you must, simply must see it. Should we go ahead and make a Katamari too? Yes, yes, let's go. So we're hopping straight into this level. Now they're, they're slurping. Interesting. We're hungry. Oh, let's roll here. This is an earth home, so unbelievably small. Plenty spacious for the prince, but not so much for us. Oh, we forgot about the Katamari. How about this much this time? To make it this big of a Katamari, so we have three minutes to make 15 centimeters worth of ca Katamari. If you can manage, that would be nice. Alrighty, the prince, it's all yours now. So, we can pick up some little things like that. Oh, your first ever roll, roll up. Very cool, so this feels pretty similar to the first Katamari where we have this big room we can just sort of walk through, we can click some stuff and, oh, it's June 10th, your roll up anniversary. I like how we can actually tell the date, interesting. Um. Let's try to pick up some of this then, and then go up here maybe. Got it. Okay, I can't quite get this egg just yet, so maybe we'll come back down. Um, we're just trying to get the 15 centimeters, but with three minutes, it's just not a ton of time, so we just really gotta roll through whatever we can, but it's getting bigger. And every time it does that, usually means that we're sort of at the next stage of picking up bigger things. And we can keep track of what we're grabbing on the bottom left. There we go, there we go, that is really helpful. So we're already up to eight centimeters. And I think there's a way to jump, if I'm not mistaken. Whoa, what did I just do? Uh, go back. I think we just did the Katamari view. Maybe there's not a way to jump, at least not yet. Well, the cat's waiting for us. We could just hop down this way, but this is where it could be a risk that there's not too many things that we can grab at our current size, but these big like chapstick rolls we can, so we might as well get those. We're at nine centimeters already, so 
We're down to two minutes, so just not a ton of time. Those little snails, can't quite grab those. But I see some extra things that I think I can grab here. Little glue sticks, whoa, lots of little bits of paint. This is where we can jump up a lot. Grab all those batteries, turn back around, and then maybe I'll rush through like that. That seems like it helped out a little bit. Now I can grab the snails. This is feeling really good now. So I think we can just keep going a little bit longer. Turn like that. Look at all this stuff. Oh, these are batteries. So we'll grab those. Maybe even try to climb up here if it lets us. Ooh, now we're getting really big. Just a little bit more. Come on, come on. A little bit with each one, 14 centimeters, we're almost done. Getting all those glue, glue sticks as much as I can, but if we can grab these, it shouldn't be too much longer now. There it is! We still have plenty of time to spare, 15 centimeters already. Hmm, 15 centimeters. So I guess that's like our minimum that we need to reach. We asked for a 15 centimeter catamaran, really? We're very hungry. We can't remember so well. So yeah, I guess we got more we can grab here. Since you're here anyway, let's make it bigger. I might as well, yeah. Let's see, 45 seconds left. So if I can grab these extra arms over this way, we're already up to 17, 18 centimeters. And the more we grow, the easier it is to grow. So that's where things can start getting out of control pretty fast in a good way, I suppose. With only a few seconds remaining, um, I might wanna get back up here. Come on, come on, got it. Just grab whatever I ended up missing here before. Come on, come on. Oh. Here's some stuff, I got another little pr little prince that you just rolled up, some weird buffness. Oh, there's plenty of stuff under the table too. Whoa, I'm just trying to make the most out of our time here. I think we did an okay job at 19 centimeters. Three more seconds, here, turn around. And then roll that way, oh, I couldn't do it quite fast enough, but okay, all done. Um, Our tummy is empty. Katamari is as big as 75 nail clippers, apparently. Shall we go home and get something to eat? Sure. That seems like a pretty impressive Katamari. We got 4.6 centimeters above what we needed for the goal, so I'll gladly take it. Ooh, we're hungry after all. We want to eat something, like this cream puff. That looks good. Oh, it's a Katamari. That was a surprise, but what What a milk toast Katamari. It's 19 centimeters, six millimeters, yes? So undistinguished. You can go bigger, you know. Do us a favor and roll a bigger one. I guess we'll try at some point, but oh. It's second cousin Macho. What were you doing on Earth? Hmm, making friends with a crayfish? We have no idea what you're talking about. Hmm, this feels, this Katamari feels necessities-ish. <laughs> so I guess our first, this sort of ranks like what we rolled up the most. So that's pretty cool. Not that we understand what necessities-ish means. I got to see the Royal Rainbow, but it wasn't exactly lively. I think it's because the Katamari was so small. I'll have to give your highness this stale old Katamari. Ooh, really? You're giving it to us? Seriously? Fabulous, thank you, we are so pleased. What should we do with it? Oh, we can pop it up into the cosmos. Yes, that's what we'll do. So I guess with each level, there might be a cousin of the prince to roll up that I guess we can unlock to sort of run around as. Oh, it's a star now, wow, it's so beautiful. Very nice, so Everyday Uranus is our next level that we just finished up there. The chapter one, the path of the lion. Whoa, what is going on now? Whoa! Who's this? I don't think that's the king. Oh no, math homework and piano lessons. I guess that's the king's father or something like that. At least seems to put them through a lot of training. Oh no. Got a little scrawl out of the tree there. Oh, here comes the car. Aw, so all the other kids were having fun. The king was too busy training. Sort of sad. That storyboard was quite interesting. It's a storyboard, but the pictures move. And there's music. An extreme storyboard, that's what it is. Mm -hmm. It's called a movie. How fascinating, a movie. So, that storyboard movie. What it showed is a glimpse into our youthful days. A pretty tumultuous tale of deferring dew. We can't wait for episode two. What? If we keep rolling, we'll eventually get to see it? Alrighty, we're going to roll on ahead. See you later. Battle mode has been unlocked. 
That's cool. Don't plan on doing that today though. So I guess there's maybe other things to do around somewhere else. Yeah, if we go over here, hey! This person's just doing some exercises. I'm really sleepy. I thought they were exercising. Maybe I guess they're just napping. I'm really sleepy, but first I want to see a big Katamari. Uh, the songs you can set to the background music increase as you play the game. So your favorite song to the BGM using Triangle. All right, well, I'll do that later. Hey, King Dude. You're so cool and relaxed lounging around as usual. I love Katamari Damacy. I love how mellow it is. So I'm copying Katamari Damacy and lounging around. Oh, now I'm falling asleep. But before I do, I want to see a real Katamari. Come on, dude, show me. Sure. So we'll do this level for sure. This might be the last one we do. We might do one more after. I'll have to wait and see. Oof. We were asleep. Were our eyes open? Oh, the prince? What? What? He wants to see a Katamari before he goes to bed? What, are you serious? No, this is Katamari Damacy. We are not that easy. We work hard at rolling, you know. No, no, not possible, cannot be done, no. Your highness is the best. The best? No, not impossible, not at all. Yes, you are very and absolutely right. If anything, we shouldn't play except just before bed, yes. All aboard, let's make ca Katamari. I like how the king is against everything until they are complimented. And then they're totally game. Oh, so we're back at the house. So sleepy after all. Yawn, let's roll here. It's a room again, but let's work on getting it big. If you make it bigger, you can roll it in lots of other places. Um, let's see. How about this much, this much time to make this big Katamari? So this time 47 centimeters, but twice as much time. If you can manage that, would be nice. Alrighty, the prince. It's all yours now. So let's just try to make as much progress as we can, as quickly as we can. The music to these games is always so good. Okay, I can't roll that over just yet, but there's some stuff maybe over this way I can pick up. Some little postcards and things. I'm starting at five centimeters. So we have a lot more left to go here. I mean, I hope we can get big enough just off of all this stuff that I can roll back around a little bit, because I can't quite grab these, it seems. Whatever they are. I don't know if there's really too much more on this table I can get to then. Yeah, none of this is really quite there for us. Okay, then we're gonna hop down this way and maybe just come back up here later because I can't really see too much what's going on. There we go, pick up some keys if I can. I really can't pick up much around here. Okay, now I can get at least a little bit of it. Yeah, get that lock and with it maybe that key. Not quite these bigger locks though. So once again, just go all the way down. Turn around like this. A little bit of a slow start so far, which I'm not so happy about, but these batteries we can pick up for sure. There we go, that will help out a ton. We'll get some little acorns over here. Go, go, go. So you can see how it's sort of this fun little arcade game where we just have to be fast and a little strategic with you know what we're getting done and when. What we'll notice is as we're rushing through and we're getting a bunch of stuff rolled up, the stuff that we were trying so hard to roll up before ends up seeming really small in comparison now once we get back over there. Oh, let's get these, yeah, these magnets seem to be a big thing that we can grab right now. So that's really nice. And then maybe along with it, plenty of this stuff. We can't get past that gate unless we're 20 centimeters. So we need to be twice as big as we are now. Okay, what can we grab around here then? Uh, so far, not too much of this stuff. So maybe just go over here. Ooh, come on, come on. Yes, we can grab all this. And it's so satisfying when we can roll everything up. Uh-oh, what was that about? Oh, there's some little mice. Grab some of these coins. Still not quite enough, quite big enough to get that cone. And grab some of these thermostats, some of these little tadpoles. It's just about rolling all over the place. Getting whatever we can. Okay, so I'm gonna try to roll over this way, pick up some stuff along the way. You can see how there's a lot more skill involved than you might think at first. Okay, got a lot of that stuff. Couple of toothbrushes too. Can't quite get that remote. Ooh. Still can't get that cone, that's crazy to me. Well, we can roll back up here. This is stuff we were struggling with before. Now we can so easily just grab it like that. Turn around over here maybe. Yep, just like that, just like that. And just get everything on this table, pretty much. Maybe not everything, but close to it. Oh, don't fall off though. Hold on, little prince. Anything over here? Ooh, lots of stuff over there actually. Very nice. Can I get the VHS tapes? Not quite. I think that's it for this table. We're still not quite at 20 centimeters. Can I get up here? Ooh, I sure hope so. It's not looking like it. I can't get under the table or over it, so that's not so good. There's plenty to grab around here. 
Definitely. Got a little credit card too. Somebody's gonna be missing that for sure. Okay, well, we're almost at the size where we can just get out of this room entirely. So I'll definitely just grab everything I can for the time being. Ooh, missed that. Cell phone <laughs> plays a little tune for us. Oh, it plays the uh, Katamari song from the previous game. I like it. Oh, and we're now we're under the table and we're grabbing a bunch of stuff because of that we're officially 20 centimeters, so we can get out of this room. Loading. Can't, okay, ah, uh, finally we can talk. We have a little trouble. You can't talk during loading, you know. We finally have our voice back, but we can't talk when it first starts loading. Yawn. Goodness gracious, we're sleepy. We are just such a sleepy head. You can get to more places if you roll on from here. We're very drowsy, but we'll keep it together. So yeah, we can get out of here. Let's make our way to the next section, which is pretty cool. I might wanna wait a moment, because we are halfway through our time and there's still so much more stuff to roll around here. Just to build up some more size. There we go, ooh, all those cans. That was a pretty good one. Got it. And then maybe all of this stuff. Just real fast, now we go over here. Grab whatever we can along the way. I'm not really the best at this game, but I'm doing what I can with the skills I have. I can't get these cats, but I can squeeze through here and we're out to the wider world. Whoa, we made our way out of the room. That's so cool. Okay, I'm rolling down all over the place, but we still need to get a lot bigger and we only have two minutes to do so. And that's where I do get a little bit worried. We won't be able to do it in time, but hopefully we can just sort of snowball out of control here in a moment. I think we can do it. We just keep rolling around as fast as we can. Get some watermelon slices over there. I can't quite grab this corn, can I? I can't, but there's a lot of little things over here I can grab, like these cans. There we go, our 30 centimeters with two minutes remaining. I'm a little nervous. Here, turn around like this so I can get a better view. That's much better. Whoa, got a lizard over here? Okay, get up here then. Oh, all these VHS tapes for sure. And then something's coming, it says. I don't know. Uh, come on, two minutes still remaining. So we're definitely running out of time. But we only need five more centimeters. So we can just get a little bit bigger. We can pick up these dustpans. One minute left. I know, I know, I'm feeling the pressure. Ooh. Oh no, oh, they're kicking me around. I don't appreciate that, but we reached the size we needed to. Fantastic, so right at the end, you're getting a little crazy here. Please don't kick me around. It's not very nice of you. Okay, so 40 seconds still remaining. Almost there, almost there. Can't read what the, the king is saying too much because we are very busy with, ow. Uh, just picking up as much as possible in the remaining half minute that we have here. Oh, got some little chipmunks we can grab. Yeah, there we go. And right now it just seems like, you know, we're starting to roll up small critters, which I sort of feel bad about. These two are just playing the trumpet. But soon enough, we'll be rolling up entire cities. That's how crazy Katamari can get. Okay, ooh, look at this picnic. Don't mind if I do, I'm just gonna scoop all this up. That was great. Got some bananas over here too. Um, ooh, grab all those. That was fantastic. So 55 centimeters, yawnies. It's finally over. Really, too sleepy. So, so nice that the Katamari is done. Yes, yeah, let's go home. So, that sounds good to me. We're heading out of here. That was a fun level for sure. And we're gone. He's still sneezing. Ah, we fell asleep with our eyes open. Oh, there is, there's a Katamari here. Came out of nowhere. We were surprised at first, but it came in a little short. Really, it's 55 centimeters, five millimeters. You could have made it a bit larger, yes. You could have made it more grande, yes. Hurry up and make the bestest Katamari ever. Hmm, this feels like, this Katamari feel, feels necessities-ish. Some more necessities. <laughs> Not the necessities-ish sounds very nice. I'm still sleepy, I'm kinda still dreaming. Probably because the Katamari is so small. You can add this one, dude. Ooh, really, you're giving it to us? Seriously? Fabulous, thank you, we are so pleased. What should we do with it? Oh. We can pop it up into the cosmos. Yes, that's what we'll do. So another Katamari flying up to the sky into the cosmos. We get every day Neptune. Oh, it's a planet now. Awesome, dude. I want to travel the universe of my dreams. Well, good luck with that. <laughs> so I think we'll go for one more level here then. We got, we love Katamari Damacy. Great. Uh, and I guess, yeah, we'll keep moving over here. Oi! Can you roll underwater? Wow, you're huge. Nice to meet you, your majesty. I don't look it, but I'm a complete brick. 
sure I can't swim, but my dream is to be something. <laughs> I'm thinking that 100 meter, meter, meter butterfly. Since I need to practice anyway, let's try rolling underwater. We couldn't go underwater in the first Katamari Damacy. What do you think, wanna roll? Sure, so I guess this is a new thing for this game that wasn't in the previous one. Ooh, yummy fresh air, look at the majesty of nature. We prefer the mountains to the beach. What about you, the prince? Hmm, water? Underwater? Not the mountains or the beach? Well, there goes our vacation. Buzz. <laughs> Katamar Damacy is great, it takes the gold medal. Gold medal. No, you're right, nothing can happen without water. The oceans, the mountains, we all owe our existence to water. Come, come, let's go rolling underwater. So this is cool, our first underwater level in Katamari. Whoa, glug glug, underwater. Okay, so we gotta get to 20 centimeters, I guess, is our goal, no, 80 centimeters. I'm immediately falling under the water, so let's just get whatever we can. Oh, it's super bouncy under here, too. Okay, this might take us a little bit to get used to. But, got a lot we can do under here. This is so cool. Got a little cat here with a little snorkel gear, too. So it might take me a little bit to get used to this, but we're picking up stuff at a pretty fast rate already. Whoa, I got hooked! I gotta escape, I gotta escape, we're getting fished up! Wow, he's reeled in, what a quirky quandary. You want to be reeled in too. You want to splash and flop and gasp. <laughs> I don't know if that's something you're supposed to want. Um, yeah, let's turn around if we can, and just try to grab as much as we can over here. Oh man, it's a very busy ocean area though, for sure. Lots of life all over the place. <laughs> Even some little bonefish swimming around. Okay, turning around again. I see a lot of little crabs we can grab like that. This enough will be big enough just to pick up all the sea life swimming around. At 33 centimeters now, but we have five minutes remaining to uh, get more stuff. All right, got it, got it, got it. Over here, whoa. Lots of little guys we can pick up. Can't quite pick up the turtle yet. Soon enough, I'm sure. Here, I'm gonna roll up if I can. Yeah, there we go, we went flying with that. Because if we got more stuff out of it. Oh, we can get whatever these are, the, the Hanawas. Can't quite get this one, that one's way too big. Okay, We're going again. Swimming over here. <laughs> is that a car? There was cats in that car over there. Interesting. Oh, and there's even like an extra level up here. See, it really does help to explore. You might be able to find tons of extra goodies. I can't quite get these little sea urchins just yet, so maybe not too worth it to be over here just yet. We'll roll off to somewhere else. I see somebody snorkeling. It's an astronaut. An astronaut underwater, huh? Interesting. Okay, what can I get here? A lot of this stuff seems to be too big for me just yet, so maybe I, I ran off too soon. I'll get what I can, whatever that is. A couple of urchins, a couple of the bigger fish. There's always a bigger fish, but will there be a bigger Katamari? Or will this be the biggest one ever? Okay, now we're getting up here. Now we can start going crazy, I have a feeling. I can grab, ooh, all these guys. Now come on, I'm falling, I'm falling. Now we can really pick up some speed and size, I think. Grab all of those guys before they get away from me. I got some of them. Oh, there's somebody watering the plants under here. That doesn't seem like it accomplished much. So silly. Okay, now we can get back to down, down to here where we were before, and there'll be so much to grab we weren't big enough to grab before. That's a huge fish over there. I love seeing all the different sea life. It's super cool. No, we got caught again. Which I guess if we did that at the right time, maybe we could get on top of that raft or something. Doesn't seem like there's much up there though. More than anything, it just eats up a ton of time as we fall all the way back down. I'm going to turn around and go this way. Grab some of these fishies. Look at all of you. Can I pick up these rocks yet? Not quite. I hear them all running away from us, which I just do not appreciate. All these little bone fish, I need to get them. There we go, thank you very much. I think I got some of the rocks here. We're at 75 centimeters, we're getting the cats now too. Ooh, now everybody's in trouble. If we can get the cats, we can get a lot of stuff, right? I hope. Here, gonna roll up like that, and ah, oh, I got hooked again. Not what I need. We're almost there though, we need less than one centimeter before the size we need to be, so. I will keep rolling things up as we get up here. There we go, we did it! We're over 80 centimeters, but we can get so much larger in the next three minutes, I'm sure of it. Let's try to roll out of control. Three minutes is plenty of time to get some major stuff. There we go. 
now we're getting big enough to just sort of get the bigger things. Oh, the king is talking, but I'm gonna have to ignore them. Here we go, look at this one. Rolling through all of that, that was a fantastic move. These spider crops are so creepy, but I will just get them wherever I can. Whoa. Here we go, grab all this stuff too. Over one meter analysis is quite the big Katamari. Definitely our biggest one yet. I will try to get right back down here. And then, can I roll? There we go, much faster. Whoa, I'm getting knocked around though. I guess the faster we go, the more we'll get knocked over. I wanna grab some of this stuff on this side though. Okay, can't quite get you, but I can go around you real quickly. Keep it moving, keep it moving. We got two minutes left, so whatever I can get here. Oh, the big golden treasure, don't mind if I do. Come on, gotcha. At least I got some of it, maybe. <laughs> Hard to tell, actually. Ooh, what's up here? Lots of stuff. Whoa, is that a picture of Pac-Man? I think it is. <laughs> it's a funny little secret, I like it. Oh, there's a mermaid up here, too. And I'll try to roll off there, just get a couple of those little uh, lifesaver kind of things. I can knock them out of the way, but I can't quite catch them. Okay, 33 seconds remaining. I can't even see what's happening. Can I grab those penguins? I grabbed one of them. All right, just a few more seconds left. They were watching TV or something. It is so hard to tell what's happening. Come on, come on. I'm getting over here now. So much stuff to grab. We're getting really out of control. I could definitely grab these guys out of the water, right? At least the penguins. And then back over here. Five seconds left. Get over there quick. It's, it's a lot slower now, but there we go. We more than doubled our original requirement. That was fantastic. Oh wait, what did I do? Uh, slot? Huh, I guess I just see different things in the slot. Interesting. Um, we're gonna go home, yep, <laughs> before the king drowns. So that was a lot of fun. You can see how Katamari can be very addicting to play. But that is so huge. Blurble, 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 fluff. Oh, it's fun to swim. By the way, we found this underwater. Looks familiar. Oh, it's a Katamari. One meter, 65 centimeters, and 75 millimeters. Looks like it might drown. It's not small, but it's not big either. You can make it bigger, yes. You can work harder, yes. I guess we could. Oh, it's cousin Marnie. What were you doing on Earth? I guess we, we rolled up our cousin there. Tell me a little tennis ball. Mm -hmm. You're riding a manta ray? We have no idea what you're talking about. This soaking wet Katamari is very aquarium-ish. Also a bit dangery and somewhat summerish too. It's kind of damp. I knew it, I knew. I know it's underwater and everything, but still, can't you be more clear about making it bigger? You can have this thing, your highness. I mean, just looking at it makes me feel like I'll never learn to swim. Oh, really? You're giving it to us? Seriously, fabulous. Thank you, we are so pleased. What should we do with it? Oh, we can pop it up into the cosmos. Yes, that's what we'll do. So just like all the others, we're gonna send this up into the sky. That was definitely the most enjoyable level yet, though. I just thought like we made good progress. So, Sea Otter Mercury. It's the age of Aquarius. That's pretty cool. So yeah, four levels completed here, and we're in chapter two, Laws of a Tiger. Oh, it's the big mo boxing match. Will the king win? Yeah, I don't think it's going so well. Oh, oh no! Not able to quite get the belt, but hey, they still get a nice number two trophy. Your father doesn't seem all too pleased. Oh no, come on, it was still our fault trophy, oh no. Poor king. Seems like the king had a very troubled childhood. But hey, we're back out here. So that was a lot of fun. Our first little taste of We Love Katamari Reroll Plus uh, something. I forget what the rest of it's called. But still, very cool game. If you guys wanna see me do a full series on this one, definitely let me know. But with that being said, that is gonna wrap it up for today's episode of Zebra's Arcade. Thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.